Hey guys, it's Ryan back here again. And to interviewing Star Wars The Black Series, Greedo. This figure is from the second wave of 6 inch Black Series in 2013, and the retail price is $19.99. Here's a nice look at the back of the packaging. Just like every 6 inch Black Series figure released so far, Greedo is a completely new sculpt. And obviously, he's based off his canteen appearance from Episode 4, A New Hope. Even though he's a rather basic alien, Hasbro captured every detail. On the back of the figure, you can see his tentacle mohawk going down the back of his head, along with the jumpsuit detailing, which includes lots and folds and creases, making it look very realistic. The sculpting work on Greedo's head sculpt is phenomenal. Just even looking at his ears, you can tell they put a lot of time and effort to capturing his full likeness. The skin is heavily textured, with scales and bumps, he has two antennas on the top of his head, along with the tentacled mohawk, and his large bug-like eyes are painted in a metallic purple color. The orange jacket, which is a separate piece, has stitching detail, along with two pockets on the front. Leading down his sleeves and onto his pants is a yellow stripe, which extends the entire length of the figure. And if you look closely, they added in darker yellow spots on the yellow lines for more realism. The belt has multiple pouches, along with a buckle, which are all painted in silver. And attached to the belt is a holster, where you can display his blaster pistol. You can remove his belt, revealing another sculpted belt underneath, which has holes in it, and is painted in brown. His left hand has his long alien-like fingers sculpted outwards, while the right hand is sculpted in a grasping pose. And like I previously mentioned, his teal jumpsuit is heavily detailed with folds and creases, and they even added in a black wash to help bring that out. Weapons and accessories include his personal blaster pistol, which is painted in silver, with a heavy black wash on top, and a removable belt. And the articulation for Greedo includes a ball jointed head with a hinge joint, ball hinge shoulders, ball hinge elbows, ball hinge wrists, ball jointed waist, ball hinge hips swivel thighs, double hinge knees, and ball jointed ankles with a rocker joint. So for about $20, you get the ultimate collector's quality Greedo. Personally, I don't think Hasbro can do any better than this. He's an amazing figure, truly unique, and something that all fans of the original trilogy should own. So anyways, that pretty much does it for this review. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you all in the next video. Subscribe for hundreds of collectible reviews, including Halo and Star Wars, and follow me on Facebook and Twitter for up-to-date channel news.